Kawhi Leonard is one of the most interesting players in the NBA. He's also one of the best. As much as he's accomplished in the game of basketball, not many people know what the fun guy is like off the court. A lot of it's because he's a very private person, but also because he doesn't have any social media. Today, I want to be giving you 5 things that you did not know about Kawhi. Number 1. After he signed his $90 million contract with the San Antonio Spurs, he was still driving a 97 Chevy Tahoe. Now this was his dad's car, who was shot and killed at a car wash he worked at in Compton, California. Kawhi has said that his greatest memories with his dad was helping him wash cars at his car wash. It was also reported that he was riding around at San Diego State in a Chevy Malibu, 2008. It wasn't until recently, when his family peer pressured him into buying a nice car, that he went out and bought a Porsche. But that car doesn't get driven that much, cause he still prefers riding his Chevys. Fact number 2 about Kawhi, he loves his Wingstop. And he's not afraid to use coupons either. Wingstop had sponsored Kawhi and had given him a bunch of coupons for free wings. In fact, he panicked one time when he couldn't find his coupons. He let Wingstop know, and they gave him a brand new packet of coupons. His favorite, apparently, is the Mango Habanero. Number 3. This past summer, he purchased a $13.3 million home in the rich affluent neighborhood of Rancho Santa Fe, which is located on the north side of San Diego. This house is 13,000 square feet and has all the luxuries you could imagine. Many thought this was a reason why that he'd be headed towards either the Lakers or the Clippers. We'll see this summer. More than likely, it's just a place for him to hang out in the offseason. Number 4. Kawhi was actually a football player when he was young. Football was a sport that his dad pushed him towards, and he even stated that he probably could have made the NFL. The positions he played were wide receiver and safety, and I believe it. With his enormous hands, athleticism, reaction time, physical tools, I think he would have been a hell of a football player. And number one. This by the way, is one of the saddest and strangest stories of them all. Now Kawhi Leonard grew up in Riverside, California which is just east of LA. He had his sights set on playing for UCLA, a big time program in the LA area. He had offers from both USC and UCLA, but towards the end of his recruitment, they started to back away from him. San Diego State stayed true to him, which is why he committed there. Now the reason why these big time programs are backing off of Kawhi, apparently is because of Renardo Sidney. Now Renardo Sidney was one of the best players in high school and his dad was the coach of an AAU team in which Kawhi also played for. At these AAU games, Kawhi would absolutely steal the show. Many scouts would come to see Renardo, but leave impressed with Kawhi. This is how he was able to attract interest from schools like UCLA and USC. Renardo's dad didn't like this. He made the AAU team so his son could get all the looks, not Kawhi. This led to him not inviting Kawhi back to the team and whenever the scouts would ask him about Kawhi, he'd badmouth him. I don't know what he was telling these scouts, but this made him back off, and USC and UCLA were no longer interested in Kawhi. I mean, things ended up working out as Kawhi is now a champion, but this is just messed up. AAU coaches were supposed to help their players get into college, not hurt them. And this sucks if you're a UCLA fan. Kawhi wanted to go to your school. This rounds up my 5 things that you didn't know about Kawhi Leonard. Is there one that you didn't know? Leave your comments down below. Alright guys, that's all I have for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates. Till next time.